Hey guys, and welcome to Telltale's Game of Thrones, the brand new game that was going to be released in December, and then boom, it's out. I didn't expect it. They didn't give us a proper date. Like, suddenly, the, I heard about that the Telltale's was making a Game of Thrones game, and I was like, oh my god, that would be amazing, because the first Game of Thrones game was garbage. We need real developers who know what they're doing to do a proper job and do justice to this. So here's a bit, of back, a bit of backstory on me and Game of Thrones. I've read all the books, or rather I'm up to date on the current release of books. They're still need, they're still being written, right? Or wrote, whatever. Um, and I've watched the, all of the HBO's TV series, which has changed some things and has some variances between the books and the show. Obviously there are changes between certain characters, who's where and what's happening and stuff. I won't spoil it, but what I must warn you now about is this takes place in season three, the show, not the books, the show. Start of season three is where this takes place and it should end just before the beginning of season four. So that's where we are right now in the world. That's what's happening. So that's that's your spoiler warning. Take that into account. I do hope that you've read the books or watched the show or both because it's an amazing world. Now, a lot of people have asked for me, Hold on, why aren't you playing the Telltales games? They're amazing. I would love to see your reaction and how you would react and the choices you would make in these games, such as The Walking Dead. And the reason I haven't done that up until now is because I would already knew what happened in The Walking Dead series and I'm not into Borderlands, so... Yeah. And dude, I've already watched... Um, or I actually watched uh, Big B. Um, I can't remember the name of that one, but Telltales game involving the fairy tale characters. Can't remember the name right now, but I've watched all of that. So it's all spoiled for me kind of so I, it wouldn't be live reactions to the, what that what happens and my own actual responses so this is the first time that I get to play a Telltale's game myself fully and show you guys as it happens and it's a Game of Thrones game I'm so excited that's enough hype now if you don't know they're released in episodes in seasons so this is the first sort of season there is six episodes right here look at this amazing artwork though and they're released every few months or so each episode i believe it might be every few few weeks or every month i can't remember the exact time between episodes but i'll be releasing my play for episodes as they come out so be ready for that here we go guys i'm really really excited for this i've got my tea uh, and everything's out of the way, man. I'm, I'm ready to go. I've got subtitles on for those of you who might not be able to hear. And I'll try not to talk over, um, you know, the interactions between people and conversations and such. Um, I will be doing a lot of listening and paying attention to the story. As you guys know, if you've watched my playthroughs, you know that. All right, guys. Hope you had time to read that. Here we go. Here we go. Fucking excited. We're celebrating. There's a few places where this could be taking place. Kingslayer, both breakers, brought to his knees by the men of the north. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Lord Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. You caught me. It won't. Now, if you've not uh, seen a Telltale's game before, um, you might not be used to the like graphic style. I have to say that I didn't really like it at first when I first saw it, when I first saw the Walking Dead game, which was their first major success. Um, and it grew on me. So if you're not really into it right now, give it a chance. It's really good. Make sure it's spotless this time. Lord Forrester won't be happy with blood and Spotless, mate. Oh, the sound, though. It's a proper sword. Yep. I'll have one like it myself someday. <laughs> oh, that accent, though. Never have a sword like that. I say that as a friend. And if we're being honest, you are just a squire. I will. You'll see. Of course, your lordship. <laughs> After you take your rightful place on the Iron Throne. Yeah. I had Andy, give me, give me know. time, man. I'll be working on it. What? Capturing him. He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. Next, he'll tell us he caught Tyrion, too. <laughs> you think he's lying? No one never lets the truth stand in the way of a good story. 
You captured the Kingslayer. Dude, that squire, well, my, my friend the squire, is kind of an ass, isn't he? Very skeptical. I suppose he's not entirely wrong, eh? Across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story. This grows more far fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Will do. Go on. Thank you for the uh, the tip. Thanks. I appreciate the You're tip. Welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Oh shit. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach. And House Tully is forever. It says a lot head. about a man who will pour wine for his like subordinates. So well. As the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. And his men clearly like him. Fetch your cup. The night we celebrate. What a nice guy. What a nice guy. <laughs> to Rob Stark, the King in the North! The, the King, 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 King in the North! North! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock. And House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the young wolf's army and ride as the vanguard. The gods have favored us. Onward to Casterly Rock! Aye! Death to the Lannisters! Aye! The North remembers! Aye! There was an option there that was winter was coming, and I'm like. That would be fun to say and everything, but I'm not a Stark I man. <laughs> to keep an eye out for Roderick, as his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question: What's to be done with you? Hey. It's been on my mind for a while now. Something must be done. What do you mean? You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? To honor? Me well. To bring honor to House Forrester, my lord. You have more honor than those who were born to it. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire, but you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Wow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Wow. Master. It's well deserved, Gary. Five minutes of playing, I'm already, I'm already a knight. work has paid off. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. But for now, keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Right. Keep it to myself. That makes Roderick sense. Will, Especially when people are drunk. Lord Forrest is a really nice man. I really like him. And the squire that I'm friends with... Not sure about him. Fetches more wine. Can you give me a hand? Sure, yeah. Come on. Make it up to you. Yeah, no problem. I have been a squire longer than you. So? I outrank you. You should help me. No. <laughs> Not so much anymore, my friend. Uh, I am a knight, but I'll still help. Cause I'm a good person, honourable. Scrub my armour, clean my boots. Just my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. This seems like a nice guy. I don't think he's arrogant either. It could be much worse. What the fuck do you know about it? Nothing is worse than Norin. That's not true. So that's He's a like nice person. No expectations. If I'd grown up covered in pig shit, shovel and slop, well, maybe I'd think saddling is Fuck all you. the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. Fuck you. I suppose this beats pig farming. I need to keep my head down, though. I can't have this guy stabbing me in the back. Ah, pig farmers. <laughs> all I'm saying is, at this rate, we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the lowest. That's far from true again. For all I know, we could be squires for life. It's not a bad fate, you know. 
But again, I'm going to keep him on my good side here. I don't want him... I want him to have my back. Because I have a feeling about where we are right now. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? That's right over there. The twins. We're at the Red Wedding. I knew it. I knew it. I was thinking season three, we were celebrating. I recognize the tents. I recognize the sort of theme and area. There's a fray here. Good thing, Lord Walders. In a generous mood. Shut up, you inbred fuck. Fucking phrase. Nice night for a wedding. Yep, they're all armed. Oh, fuck. Yeah, they're about to betray us. Yep. Oh, boy. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, my God. I should probably tell this, this friend of mine to uh, get the fuck out. Seriously. We need to leave. What's wrong? We need to leave. We need to leave. We need to go now. Oh my god. Into you. You're acting rather odd. We need to go. No, we need to leave. We need to go. We need to go. Take the fucking flagon already. We need to go. What's wrong with him? Something the matter? Bowen, we have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. Oh god. I, 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 I'm sorry, Bowen. You're kind of an ass. Forrester needs to be saved. He's more important than you. He's more important than you. Oh, God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Holy shit. I'm sorry, Bowen. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. All right, look. We got to get to... Oh. <laughs> we got to get to Forrester right now. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Ooh. Oh. I'm just a square, I'm just a square, I'm not a knight, I'm not a knight. Ugh. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, good. We at least got Roderick here. Nice. Roderick. Fuck yes. Oh, fuck. Um. <laughs> oh, there's a shield there, how convenient. Let me grab it. Give me the shield, give me the shield. Give me the shield smash! Shield smash, shield slam, just like playing WoW. Oh shit, Roderick. Uh, there's a guy with a spear behind me. Those are some of the men that we saw. I recognize his mutton chops. We're nearly there, we're nearly there. Shoot that one! Uh, no, 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 no! Oh shit. Well, I fucked that up, didn't I? Um. Second attempt. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. This one. Fuck him up. Shield slam, bitch. Oh, fuck. Oh, thank you. Thank you for saving the day there, friend. I got it. I oh. oh, don't run into it. What are you doing? What are you... I should have gone under faster, probably. And I'm going a bit slow. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. This is really, like, why did I choose to do this? Honestly. Fuck. Fuck. Come on. There, there, there. There, no problem. I lost my shield, though. I kind of wish I still had that. Okay. No shield now. Bit of a problem. Let's dodge that, please. Thank you very much. Okay, down. Up, oh, up, oh, up. Oh. Okay, got it. Okay, right, all right, all right, all right. Get off me, get off me, get off me. Come on, I'm going to press in this queue so hard. I'm pressing this queue so hard. Oh, God. Um, uh, we're totally going to die if you don't get off me. Like this, and then this, and then this. Like that. Ooh. Kick you, fuck you, die. <laughs> um, I'm, not, I'm not enjoying this experience right now. I want to be a knight, not a squire still. Oh, my God, you idiot. Why did you distract him? That's Roderick! Good fucking riddance. That was a good man, and I kind of killed him, I think, by calling his name. Fortunately, we have Forrester still alive. Most important guy. Bald man's dead. Yes! Got it. Did you find Roderick? He's dead. Speak up, Garrett. Did you see him or not? The phrase. They... They slaughtered him, my lord. Ah, uh, fuck. We need to leave right now. 
Where's my squire? You didn't leave him, did you? What happened to him? I had to leave him. I had to leave him. I had no other choice. Just the truth is important. Find a weapon. Quickly. Um uh, Ooh, that's a weapon. I'll grab that. Uh well I guess not. No, I said I'll grab it, so I said I'll grab it, so I'll grab it. Thank you, Lord Forrester. Please take the weapon now though. Oh fuck! What was with the mo romantic stare? You fucking traitor! Go, my lord, while there's still time. Yeah, good call. Let's get out of here. Dude, that long sword that he's using is so fucking awesome. Oh fuck. Come on, come on. Seven hells. To keep moving. Have to keep moving, my lord. I'd never make it. They'll hunt us down like dogs. No, no, come on. They're not gonna catch you. We just need to go. Ah. Oh. Okay, maybe you're dead. <laughs> maybe you're dead. Guard this with your life. Return it to Ironrath, where it belongs. There's no time to waste. <sighs> Upgrade. <laughs> Fuck, man. I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. You have to go. I'll do as you command. I gotta get out of here. Do as you command, my lord. You have served me well. I know I can count on you. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. The Tell North no Grove. Him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. I swear that I will, my lord. Hey, it's those foresters. I've got to remember to do that. You must do this for your house. Go! Kill those fucking foresters! Come on! Oh! We love to the fray. No! All my friends are dead. It's been like 20 minutes or something, and I, all my friends are dead. Oh my god! What an opening! What an opening! Oh my god! That was amazing. I was like, I realized right off the bat, where am I? This feels bad. Ah, yes. This is brilliant. This is brilliant. Look at that. I, I'm sorry. They've done a great job with the map here. Here is the bridge. That's where we, ju we just were, in fact. The twins. Here's the, uh, the northern wall. Castle Black. The elevator that goes up. Over to the west here. We have Iron Reach. That's actually where I, the foresters live. And that's their, like, area, I guess. So we're just slightly north. Uh, we're slightly west of the wall. That's where our home is. Episode 1, Iron from Ice. What an opening, though. What an opening. I'm really, really enjoying this. Ah, oh, the sword looks good, but we need to get rid of that blood. It's gonna rust. Hello, piggy. Hello. You will be my mount. <laughs> All right, let's have a look around. We need to check the area. If there's a pig, that means there's people, right? And I don't know whether they're attackers. Maybe they're pig farmers. You know, we were once pig farmers. You know, we'll know. We'll know the deal, dude. That sword is massive. Hang on, there's blood here. Blood. Is it warm? Fresh. It's fresh. Okay. It's not long ago. So. Maybe there was a traveller, and the traveller was attacked. Maybe by the phrase. We're still in the area, right? We're on our way north, and at this point, um, we've been betrayed. Not by just the phrase, but 
Um, also, the Skinners. I can't remember their actual house name. Um, God. Sorry, it's been a little while since I've read the books. And, uh, well, I mean, it's not been too long since the series. I really should remember. Let's have a look. Yeah, it looks like my guess was right. Uh, looks like a merchant's... That's father's car. No. Not just any merchant, but your father. Lord Bolton better give us Bolton's, that's what I meant, yeah. Uh, it's... Is that Lord Bolton himself? It's just a pig! Get down. Move along, boy. There's nothing for you here. Father. I said move on. Unless you want to get fed to the fucking pigs. Fuck you. I'm going to kill you. Is that so? That's right. You can try if you like. And then we'll feed you to the pigs. Get off my land. This is Bolton land now, boy. Lord Bolton is the new warden of the north. I reckon he'd like a proper lordly sword like that. You think? Maybe he would. Maybe he would. But he's not going to get it. No. Oh, uh, don't look at your dad. I'll have that sword, boy. Come get it. Come get it, you bastard. Oh no. Oh my god, really? I guess he just outskills me. Alright. Finish this fucking big farmer. Alright. Alright, I gotta take out his men first. That'll do. That'll do. Okay, no, no. Uh the range. I want range. I want range. He's got a sword, I want range. That's it. Like this. Goodbye, sword. Goodbye, you, dickhead. All right, we got the axe next. Oh, shit, I kind of wish I kept the range now. Because he's got a pike. Dodge. Come on, come on, come on. Dodge. Ah, uh, you're using the sword against me, you dick. Fuck you. Give me the sword. Get the sword, get the sword, get the sword. Yeah, it fell far, didn't it? Oh, fuck. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. That's it. There we go. See you later. Oh, the leg. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Mercy. Please. You're going to get attacked by the other guy. You're going to get attacked by the other guy. So do I. And you you were going to kill mine. I'm going to show Mercy, though. I'm going to show Mercy. Thank you. I'm an honorable son of a gun. Now get out of here. Who knows, maybe he'll help me in the future. For this. That much I promise. All right, well, I guess we can't stay here anymore, but I saved my dad, right? Father? Uh, he's been stabbed. You survived. Your sister. Oh, she hid. Oh, good. She's a... Oh. Maybe I should have killed him. I tried to stop them. Oh, my God. Well, there goes my family. I'll kill the men who did this. I think saving that man and showing mercy in that moment may have saved saved me down the line. Or it could stab me in the back. Look at that, though. That is beautiful. It's Garrett. Get the castellan. Tell him his nephew survived. I kept my word. I brought the sword. I wasn't gonna give. I was not gonna get rid of it, and I wasn't gonna back down either. Oh fuck! Garrett. I'm 
was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester. Meet us in the great hall. Quickly. I think we survived, guys. Two White Hill soldiers and a Bolton. So the White Hill soldier I spared. And for what? But the Bolton I wouldn't have. My sister, she... She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, mister. That's gonna hurt. Mm, the blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I can still fight. Your justice was swift. Some will call it vengeance. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. But the White Hills won't see it that way. I spared they one. Me. I spared one. I had one. no choice but to defend myself. Of course. And we can't let the White Hills just walk all over us. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. I honestly think I made the right choice with that mercy. Hold the wound open for me, would you? Oh, fuck. This is good. It's disgusting. Alright. Oh, sorry if you're not into this. Ugh. Gross. Oh, that's gross. The dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. It's a ni nice painting. Poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Our house will never fall. By the gods, let's hope you're right. The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Although he is young and altogether unprepared to lead. Should be me. Right. Uh, this might hurt a bit. Yeah. Yeah, I imagine. Hold this for me, will you? You seem like a nice guy. I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. His Roderick... Roderick sort of hold himself. He was fine. Himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel doesn't train maesters in the art of warcraft. I need to bring the message. Me a message to deliver. A message? About what? The sword. What did he tell you? The North Grove as well. It's from my uncle. Get my uncle. I was told only to tell him. Your uncle? I see. Must be rather important. Then. I'm glad that you understand. Lady Forrester. I can't tell anyone. Moment now. He like told me not to tell anyone, first. apart see from the uncle. Put any weight on that leg. A little bit. We're okay. We can walk. Go on. Don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate that. Man, that sword is a fine-looking sword. I'm glad that I opted to fight for it. And uh, we managed to bring it back. I'm going to lose it soon, I have a feeling. But uh, that's okay. You know, it's not my sword and it's not meant for me. But it was cool that I got to use it while I could. Otherwise, guys, I want to say thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, please leave a like. There will be more regularly until we finish this episode. And I'm very excited for that. I shall see you next time. I've been Hall, you've been you. Have a good day.